What percent of the drama club members enrolled at a certain school are female students? Well, in order to answer this question, we would either have to know the number of female students and the number of male students in the club, or we'd have to know the ratio of female students to male students in the club. One way or another, we'd have to know one of those two kinds of pieces of information in order to answer this question. So statement number one tells us of all the females at the school, 40% are members of the drama club. So 40% of all females are in drama. Well, by itself, first of all, we know 40% of all females, but we don't know how many females. So we don't have a count. We don't know the exact number. And more importantly, we get zero information about males in this statement. We have no idea. Maybe there are no males in drama, or if there are, we have no idea how many. So this by itself is insufficient. Now block statement one out of your mind and focus only on statement number two. Statement number two tells us of the males enrolled at the school, 25% are members of the drama club. So 25% of all males are in the drama club. Well now a similar set of problems. We don't know the number of males, so we don't know the number of men in the drama club. And more importantly, this statement gives us zero information about females. So we have no way to know, are there females in the drama club? And if so, how many? We have no way to know that. So statement number two by itself is insufficient. Well, now when we combine statement number one and statement number two, this is interesting. So we have all the females at the school, all the males at the school. Of these females, 40% go to drama. Of the males, 25% of them go to drama. Well, the problem is we still don't know the number of females and the number of males in the school, and we don't even know the ratio. If, for example, we were guaranteed that there was a one-to-one -one ratio, that there were just as many females as males, well, then we could figure something out, but we have no idea. This could be a school where there are hundreds of females and only a couple males, or it could be a school where there are hundreds of males and only a few females. We have no idea of the overall ratio, and because of that, we have no way to figure out the ratio in the drama club. So even combined, this is still insufficient, and answer choice is E.